Motivation is what gets you started. Commitment is what keeps you going. Jim Rohn. My daughter Elena started training at KMMA at just three and a half years old. Tomorrow, she's actually going to be seven for Krav Camp. Her second Krav Camp, I should add. I'm so grateful to my amazing wife, Kimberly, for leading us to KMMA all those years ago. Among, of course, all the other reasons I'm grateful for her every single day for all the things she does for us. We're so proud of the strong, confident young lady Elena has become. Due in great part to the lessons she receives from the KMMA teachings in this wonderful tribe every single week. Us adults in the KMMA tribe often ponder, wow, how wonderful it is to have this level of programming for success at such a young age. At KMMA, we learn the superpowers of focus, respect for ourselves and others, of course. Discipline, gratitude, and vision. Finally, and frankly, I consider these things immeasurably important to success in any area of your life that you want to attain. I actually had to learn all these things the hard way. Maybe I'm a little bit hard-headed. I joined the Air Force at a young age where the core values of success were enshrined in me and my fellow airmen at 0500 in the morning as we're standing in formation shouting, integrity first, service before self, excellence in all we do. Huh. <laughs> Striving to live up to those values led me to graduate training in the top 10% of my class with honors, received several commendations for various missions supporting national security as well as the war on terror. Continuing to try to thrive by those principles, I continue to develop professionally becoming the first person in my family to obtain a graduate degree, or excuse me, a four-year degree, and then going on to obtain a graduate degree, and being very um, blessed to hold several professional leadership roles throughout my professional career, both in the military as well as the private sector. I'd venture to say that, you know, this success is really due in part to all those lessons that I learned along the way, the very lessons that we embody every single day here at KMMA, and then all these young people have the, the great privilege to learn from these great grandmaster, sensei, and fellow tribe in Shihan. When I was young, I actually earned a yellow belt in karate as a kid, but frankly, I never really had the commitment to stick with it. Or maybe I didn't really have someone forcing me to stick with it. It's probably a big part of it. That's that part of the motivation that you might need at first, right? Is somebody holding a gun to your head, kind of, kind of proverb. When Elena first started KMMA, I had just started a new job. And although I was interested in joining after watching all those fun classes from the bench, I didn't think I could make the commitment. If I'm being honest, I'm sure a bit of that was even the fear. The fear of getting off that bench. The fear of starting something new getting out of my comfort zone. I went on for about two whole years watching her from that bench every single week, almost daily, working hard in my career, and when time permitted, showing up and supporting Elena. I actually began to find myself in a bit of a rut as I was spending so much time and energy on my career. I realized something really had to change, something had to give. That's when I made the commitment to join Elena, to get off the bench, to lead by example, to join this wonderful program and give back to this wonderful program. And when I do something, I have a tendency to go all in. And I did just that. I joined the Black Belt Leadership Program. I even joined the Elite Training Course as a yellow belt. I went all in. Never did I think I would realize so much personal growth as a result of that commitment. The commitment. The friendships that I've forged, the lessons that have been reinforced, and the character developed has, quite frankly, been life-changing. I say this often, and I think it really embodies it best, that KMMA makes me a better person. No matter what you want to achieve in life, the biggest step is often finding the motivation and the courage to get off the bench. Take that first step. 
then we must make a commitment to stay in the game. Thank you.